Boys, welcome back to another Bro Coasties video. As you see, we're doing something a little bit different. We're on Underdog Fantasy doing the Mitten. This draft is not like normal fantasy football. You're drafting players for the NFL playoffs. So you want to draft players that you think their team is going to go far, maybe win the Super Bowl. For example, if you draft a guy like Najee Harris and they lose to the Chiefs first round, you can't use him anymore. He's out, the team's out. And boys, before you get into it, if you want to do the Mitten or even we're doing other drafts with you guys on Underdog, Go and download Underdog Fantasy and use code BROS. If you use code BROS, they'll match your first deposit up to $100. So say you put in $10, they'll put in $10 of your own. These are $5 drafts, and boys, let's just get right into it. You okay, boys, we're entering right now. Get right into it. Um, allow notifications, yes. Okay, six people drafts. Waiting for it to fill up. Oh, okay, wow. We're pick four. Pick four. Dude, pick Yikes. four is like the worst pick. Yeah, pick four kind of sucks. Cooper Cup, best player. Because the Rams are a good team. You could argue Devontae Adams. He just doesn't play week one, but they could go to the Super Bowl. The clear one and two. Yeah, that's another thing. You don't, you're, you, the Packers and Titans are a little risky because they have that bye. They're not going to play for you week one. So say your other players don't do so well, you could get eliminated super early. Pick number four, who are you hoping for right here? I mean, obviously, Cup or Adams, probably not going to happen, but we'll see. We might, it's risky. We might even go Mike Evans yeah. and then Tom Brady. I don't. Hate I, it. I do like the Bucks sack. They play the Eagles week one. I feel like that's probably the most guaranteed game. They should destroy the Eagles or at least win nonetheless. So you're gonna get good performance week one, guaranteed another performance. I do like the the Bucks stack. There's also the Bills, Diggs, and Josh Allen, but they aren't guaranteed to win. Of course, they're they're favored yeah. over the Patriots, but it's not guaranteed. And even if they beat the Patriots, they're probably gonna face the Chiefs the next week. So like the Bills could get knocked out early this year in the playoffs. That's why their guys are a little risky. Pick one. Probably gonna be Cooper Cup. Yep. It's it's got Tyree, Tyree Hill. Hill. That's perfect. If Whoa. Cup or Adams could fall to us, that would be so beautiful. Travis Kelsey. Kelsey, we're gonna get Devontae Adams or Cooper Cup, boys. This is what you call a beauty star. Patrick Mahomes. Do we go? Do we go Cooper Cup? We go Cooper Cup? How did we get Cooper Cup at pick number four? We've done multiple of these drafts, and I've never seen him go past two boys. That me up right <laughs> now. Cooper Cup, the best fantasy player. We just got him at number four. The Rams are also a solid team. They could easily go to the Super Bowl. Devontae Adams is falling so insanely far. Like, I don't even know what's going on here. Yeah, Devontae, Devontae Adams, Adams at six. six. Wow. These dudes are crazy. This is going to be an interesting draft. We got. Do we go A-Rod? What if we go Diggs and Josh Allen? What if we can get the Diggs Josh Allen stack? We're not, we have a pick here, then we're going to be like six picks away. Oh, yeah. Sorry, I'm my brain turned off for a second. Who do we go? Aaron Rodgers and just get that stack? The thing is, we could get eliminated week we one. We don't have a stack. Oh, well, I thought we had Devontae. I'm yeah, tripping no. out. Yeah, let's go. Should we go Diggs? Or, or do you like Jamar Chase? Jamar Chase falls in a lot of these. Do we go Aaron Rodgers? We, I feel like we have to go Matthew Stafford later. I think we get Jamar Chase or Diggs, whatever one you're feeling in. I think I like Jamar Chase. Jamar Chase. Okay, okay. The thing is, Jamar Chase, the Bengals do have a pretty easy schedule. They go, I think, they go Raiders. Then if they win, they'll probably play Titans. They could easily win both those games. They make it to the semis. That's super solid. The guy got digs. Like, man, I cannot believe we got Cooper Cup at the... Here, was Jamar forward. Chase, was that, was that bad? I don't know. Eh, I would have maybe leaned digs, but I don't hate Jamar Chase there. Okay. I do not hate him. Next oh. up. So we're trying to build Rams and Bengals now? Yeah, and one thing about this is you want to build, like, you want to build your team. Leonard Fernand, I almost wonder if we have to go Matthew Stafford here just in case. What about Burrow? We, oh, yeah, we could go Burrow. That's actually a good point. We could very well go I Burrow. I wonder if just take the best player here, like Mixon. Mixon. And Yo, what Burrow? if we get Mixon and Burrow? Okay, we're really heavily rooting on the Bengals in this draft, <laughs> but I'm not hating it. Okay, let's just queue up Mixon. I kind of like Mixon if we can get Burrow. Or if Stafford falls, either or. Yeah, it'd be a beauty. I'm liking it. Just hope Mixon doesn't get taken. Mixon got taken. <laughs> wow, I'm dead inside. Um, Do we go T. Higgins? No, nah, I'm not loving it. I'm not hating it, though. Here, who are we feeling here? No Aaron Jones, no Gronk. I almost wonder if T. Higgins Do we goes. go T. Higgins? I'm just going to queue him up. Let's queue up T. Higgins. If, someone, if, the, if Stafford and Burrow goes, I'm going to cry. That but, would, yeah, that would be brutal. I think we go T Higgins. I like it. Do we do we just go T Higgins? Yeah, we're really heavy on the Bengals. If you had to choose, who do you like more, Joe Burrow or Matthew Stafford? I think I like Stafford a little bit. Like Stafford a little bit. Okay, I'm good with that. But ideally, ideally we have a cho choice. But even if just one falls, even if just one it. falls, we're good. What are the chance Cooper Cup falls to four? That's absolutely absurd. Wrong. Wrong. Okay, two picks left. Did they go the two quarterbacks? 
Let's just cue them both up. Yeah, cue them both up. ADP twenty seven thirty one. We gotta take them though. Is it? Yeah. Is it too early? Nah. Like if they both go, we're screwed. That's fair. Z. Okay, we're guaranteed one of them. Let's go. We're guaranteed one of them. What are you feeling if we have? To, I think we go Stafford. Even though Burrow's been way better. I think so. Maybe not, but Stafford's been kind of garbage. I don't know. Maybe I'm hating, but yeah, actually, yeah. yeah. How about? What if we don't go either QB? Then we hope one. And it's risky, and but risk it for the biscuit next round. But I guess who would we go at that point? Singletary. I think I think we gotta go one QB. Who are you feeling? Do we go Burrow? Risk it all. Here I chose. I chose Jamar Chase. You choose this one, dude. I don't know, bro. I'm tripping out. I'll check you up Burrow just in case. Let's go Burrow. We're going. Burrow. Are you good with Burrow? Yeah, we're reaching a little bit, but we're heavy banking on a Bengals Rams Super Bowl. After this, though, we have to go. We have to get Odell later. We have to get a couple guys. Good thing about this is we can wait till the end of the draft. And guys like Najee, guys like Darren Waller, guys like Hunter Renfro, they just don't get drafted high. Those are great players to help you carry you through the first couple rounds because they might have first round. First round, yeah. They might not win their matchup, but if they get up, put up good points, they'll carry you right through to the next rounds. Okay, who are we looking for? We don't double up on quarterback, do we? Heck no. I don't think we do. I think it's too early. Okay, what are we looking for? Do we want? I think we go Odell. Odell? If he's available. He does fall in some of these drafts, but I just... Oh, no, I'm just going to take it. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? Um, it means we have to go Van Jefferson. We have to get a running back from the Rams. Man, I wish we got mixed in there. That was a bit unfortunate, but I'm not hating it. Do we go Sony? Do we go Sony? I think Sony, if I had to say one running back, I think he's going to be the running back there, but... Let's just queue him up. I'm liking this team though. Rams, Bengals, we'll just solidify the core, and then at the end of the draft, we'll draft players that can carry us through the couple first couple rounds. Yeah. So you agree? Next pick is Sony, or do we wait a little bit? I'm not. I'm down for it. I like Sony. Yeah, I'm good with it too. Who else could we go as a carry through? None of these guys I like. AJ Dillon, Ant, Knox, and eh. Damian Harris is decent. I don't hate Damian Harris. James yeah. Conner is decent. Ben Jefferson's pretty good. I mean, just for our stack, I mean. Yeah. Kittle. Do we go? Kittle. Do we need Acres later? I don't yeah, know. I would take Acres at the end. Sony, just take Sony, him. take Sony. Get him on the squad. Get him on. He for sure got more carries than Acres. Maybe it's because Acres was you know a bit injured still, but hey, we're liking the team. We're halfway through. There's ten rounds. G so pick ten players, and yeah, we never explained. There's one QB starting. One running back, two wide receivers slash tight ends, and one flex. So only five of your guys are actually going to start. And you don't even need to update your lineups on the mid. The best ball just means to auto-update the lineup. Okay. I think we do a guy that will carry us through. Do we go, like, Damian Harris or Dalton Schultz? What do you think about that? I wonder if we go Damian Harris the running back just because Sony. Yeah, I like I it. I don't know. Because Sony is a little risky. Yeah, I would go with Damian it. Harris. Man. I'm liking the team. I think we for sure need Van Jefferson because we only have like two Rams right now. Yeah. For sure Van Jefferson next round. We got Harris. Is Staff- Stafford <clears throat> still here if we want? Dude, I'm honestly kind of for it. I'm fine going to QB. I yeah. don't hate it. There's, well, that's there's, actually... four, there's four picks left. Man, we probably could have waited on Burrow and Stafford, but I'm down for it. Stafford just got picked. Never mind. Cross that out. Man, that dude... Got far down to pick thirty four, wow, because we're obviously we're done with QB. We're riding Joe Burrow to the end. Can Joey B carry us through? Okay, next pick. Yeah, what are we so thinking we, here? I think we gotta get Van Jefferson. We gotta solidify that. Even if we're reaching reaching a little bit, I think we just gotta do it. Tyler Boyd. Do we want Boyd with Jamar Chase and Higgins? I just I feel like it's maybe a bit too much value. I think it's better to go with guys that might help us carry us through. Do we want Kittle? I honestly like Cam Kittle. Akers. We for sure need Cam Akers. Elijah Mitchell to carry us through. Okay, okay. Um, I like guys like Najee, like end round. So we have four picks left. We're for sure taking Van Jefferson and who's the other guy? Cam Akers. For yeah. sure going those two guys. Any more Bengals we want? Like, we don't want P. Ryan, do we? Has Tyler Boyd been taken? No, he's Tyler Boyd still here if we want. Okay, let's just go Jefferson. Go Van Jefferson. Man, if Bengals, Rams make the Super Bowl, again, 
Normally on the big man drafts, you pick two teams they think might make it and you draft your team around those two teams. Usually you can do it in many different ways, but that's what a lot of the winning team have. Like last year, the winners had like, they obviously predicted the Bucks, Chiefs, Super Bowl had a bunch of players from there. They also had Browns players. Because if you remember, the Browns had two big boom weeks in the playoffs last year. But hey. Okay, what are we wanting to do here? I think we go with someone to maybe help carry us through. Is Debo's gone, right? Debo looks like he's gone. Who else? What's a team that could like maybe win? Kittle? They could beat the Cowboys. They could. They totally could. Hardman. I- None of these guys are big yeah, carries. None of these are standouts. Obviously. I mean, Deontay and Devontae and Renfro. Yeah. I for sure but. say I like Deontay more than Devontae Smith. I don't really see the Eagles. Eagles are versus the Bucks, right? The kiddo was just taken. Dang, son. Um, okay. Do we just take Cam Akers here? Yeah, I'm down. Let's do it. Solidify that? Yeah. And then... As we see, we have two picks left. I Do think, we need Henderson? Just get all three of them? Nah. You know? Because I think Henderson's clearly got replaced. Even when he was healthy, Sony was more than him. Lazar just got taken. Okay. Here we got four receivers slash tight ends, three running backs, one QB. Do you agree we don't take any more Rams or Bengals? I think yeah, we go two guys to help us. Yeah, I yeah. agree. Help us get us through the first couple rounds. Let's just think. We don't have any guys with buys, right? Yeah, no Burrows. Yeah, all these guys... All these guys play week one. I think we need a running back. Okay, okay, I'm down. Elijah Mitchell, is that our best option? Elijah Mitchell or Najee? The thing is, I think Najee might put up more points week one, but I think Elijah Mitchell has a better chance of advancing. Do you think your team's good enough to win week one? Uh, Jamar Chase, Cooper Cup could pop. Yeah. Joe Burrow could pop. I don't know. What do you think? I honestly, I wonder, what if we go, like, Josh Jacobs? Do we go Josh Jacobs, like, last round? Is yeah. there a really good receiver? That the we one can... thing, though, is, like, Josh Jacobs, if the Raiders win, this draft's screwed anyways. So I don't know if we want to do that. Right. Maybe we do go Najee. You like Najee? I like Najee, I think. Najee's um... completely getting underdrafted. Oh, he got picked. He got picked. Oh, Najee got picked. What about Deontay? Or Elijah Mitchell. Let's go Elijah yeah, Mitchell. let's just do Elijah Mitchell. I'm honestly liking the squad quite a bit. Oh, whoops. I clicked the wrong thing. Okay, he's queued up anyways. Yes, sir. Okay, there we go. Okay. <laughs> For sure, no more running backs. If the Bengals Rams make the Super Bowl, boys, I think you can bring us our 15K. But, yeah. again, if you win the big men, there's 100K total in prizes. Each round you move up, you get a bit more cash. Again, $5 entry. And if you win it all, $15,000 in your pocket. But it's not really about the money. It's so fun doing these drafts. Sometimes it's about the money. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> okay, last pick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't go Bengals. We don't go rounds. We need one guy to... And I believe if you move on even to the next round, I think you make... You make $1. You make, you make $6. So as long as you make it to the next round, you make... You guarantee to make your money back. back. Yep. Okay, so Let's I see. think we go Deontay. I'm feeling Deontay, honestly. Because we just picked Elijah Mitchell. We got that NFC. I think we go Deontay... Again, you never know. Maybe the Steelers could stun them. I don't think they will. But even if they're down, they're going to have to throw it. And Deontay could put up good numbers week one just to help us carry us to round two. Just give a quick little look. I think we go Deontay, but five seconds anyways. I'm liking the team, boys. This is probably... We've done lots of these men drafts. This honestly might be my favorite one. I mean, getting Cooper Cup at four, never seen that. <laughs> That's an absolute steal. So, it's, it's this solid team. I mean, we're banking hard, obviously, on Bengals, Rams. Probably not going to happen in the Super Bowl, but hey, if it does happen... Yeah, the thing is, like, how many people are doing Bengals-Rams? we got the best players from the Bengals and the Rams, minus, like, Joe Mixon and Odell. Yeah, Joe Mixon would have been nice for this team. Yeah. Let's see, it's end off the draft. we got Hardman. Dude, I feel like Deontay Johnson's underdrafted. Nick Westbrook, the Titans wide receiver. This 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 guy's team. A-Rod, Kyler, Mixon, C.H., Najee, Kelsey, Odell. This guy's not even building the team. Two teams. He's just drafting who he likes, I guess. Okay. Respectable, yeah, let's, I guess. Let's look at this guy's team. Patty Stafford, Henry. There we go. Dude's a first round exit. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> and boys, if you didn't, again, I don't think we explained this, but two people in your draft make it onto the next round. Then you go into a pool of eight people on the min. If you win that next round, if you win the next round, I think it's 10 people you move on. Then you're in a pool of 94 people. And if you win that 94 pool, you get that 15K. 
The men's so fun to do. Draft board. Again, go up. I don't know how the three Chiefs went one, two, and three. That is absolutely absurd. I know. That Cooper was Cup at four. Even Devontae at six. I know. Like, Here, let's take, just give a quick little look at the whole draft board. Man, I'm liking I'm liking it. it. I kind of liking the team. I'm liking the Wait, team. Let's quickly, how do I get out of here? So week one, like we said, Burrow, QB, probably Damian Harris, Elijah Mitchell, and then Maybe Sony or Akers. We only need one of those to start, really. Yeah. And then Cooper Cup, obviously, is going to be a starter. Chase, Higgins, all great. Jefferson's more so for future if the Rams win. Deontay helped us carry through. I, I like this team. I like it, too. I like it a lot. Awesome. Should we end it there? Okay. Boys, thanks for watching. Again, if you want to do the big men, not the big men, the men, or just like any draft us in the offseason, go to Underdog. Use code BROS. Match your first deposit up to $100. Thanks, boys, for hopping in. We'll see you all later.